Hey guys, what's up? It's Dan Weinberger here, CEO and co-founder of Morpheus Network, uh, here with another AMA, a little bit different style of an AMA. Uh, I've seen in the uh, Telegram channel a lot of the same sort of questions flying back and forth. Uh, I've had some amazing community members uh, message me directly. Uh, whoever wants to reach out directly, always feel free to uh, ask me some questions as well. A lot of repeating questions. So uh, I thought I'd go through some of these uh, you know, sort of topics, discuss them right now in, in a sort of uh, topic-based AMA. So uh, without further ado, uh, I'll go through these topics. If I missed anything, obviously send me some more questions as well. Uh, let's get back on that, that Reddit AMA page as well. Uh, so I can, you know, access that easily as well and be able to do these AMAs for you quite regularly. So uh, regardless, let's move on. So we had a bunch of questions on uh, on exchanges, uh, great questions as well. <clears throat> so I've, you know, mentioned obviously in the past that we're working with a bunch of different exchanges uh, in order to get the, the token itself, the utility token listed on those exchanges. Uh, we recently have been uh, listed on gate.io. Uh, that is like a, a top, 10, top 10 exchange based on volume. Uh, that wasn't the exchange that I was referring to when I mentioned a tier one based exchange. Uh, an exchange is talked about quite a bit in the uh, Telegram channel as well. Uh, that narrows it down to a few different exchanges as well. Um, I, we do hope to, to be listed and have that completed this quarter. Uh, obviously, right now we're going through that token swap, which is going amazingly well, extremely smoothly. Uh, I wanted to thank the community. Uh, both the community uh, administrators uh, as well as the community members who aren't even administrators helping all the different community members figure out how to get that swap done properly. Uh, some people just, you know, uh, purchase tokens, which is great. Uh, and then we'll hold on to those tokens forever uh, and not really pay attention too much about, oh, I have to update my, you know, my firmware or whatever it is to, to make that swap happen, you know, smoothly and correctly. So thank you to the community members who've helped out those other community members uh, who are, you know, not so well versed in making those swaps happen. Uh, I want to thank uh, Noel Meppel, uh, you know, my co-founder and CEO, COO of Morpheus. Uh, he was, you know, has been great, of great help to specific community members who need some personal attention. I know I'm taking some extra, you know, extra time out of his, you know, extremely busy schedule uh, and help them out with that swap directly. So uh, thank you to Noam for, you know, alleviating some of the stress for some of our amazing community members as well. Uh, I will mention when it comes down to the uh, the exchanges as well, um, you know, we're right down the line uh, where it comes to, you know, with third parties, I, I mentioned exchanges, but that comes to our implementations as well with our clients, uh, any other partnership that we have, there's a third party, uh, the, the, you know, the timing uh, of any sort of estimates uh, on my end isn't always set in stone, right? I don't control all the timing, uh, especially when it comes to exchanges that, you know, we have to follow their rules uh, that they dictate, which is great. Uh, we're following those rules. It's no problem. We're not in a rush necessarily. Uh, and as soon as we're listed, obviously the, the community will know about it. Uh, we're very excited about it. And there is a tier one exchange that very soon uh, we will be announcing. Uh, it should be this quarter as well. So uh, thank you for that. Uh, I have a lot of questions as well uh, on our staking program or master nodes, node systems. Uh, all the, obviously, we've had these questions for a couple of years now. Uh, very excited about it. Uh, we've actually unleashed a secret community member to take care of some last critical steps for the nodes. Uh, we'll have some details for the community very, very shortly. Uh, very excited about that. Uh, one thing that I will let you know, uh, we mentioned we'll have initial nodes come out. Uh, you, we won't necessarily call them test nodes because it'll be actually real running nodes uh, called the alpha nodes. Uh, we've had some, some people actually come to us say they want to be those initial test nodes. They want to be those alpha nodes as well. Uh, some influencers as well. Uh, some people within supply chains, companies we work with as well. Uh, so we'll have some really great alpha nodes. Uh, and then we'll obviously scale up to beta nodes as well. Uh, you know, the point of having these master nodes as well is, you know, a big part of it is decentralization. Uh, in order to have decentralization, we do require a large number of nodes in the network. Uh, so very excited about that, obviously. Uh, looking forward and discussing even more. Whoever works on that project, uh, the developers, uh, you know, uh, the secret community member, secret community member, myself and Noam, whenever we're working on that project, specifically the node systems, uh, really excited about it. I can't wait to tell you guys more about it. Uh, once again, so important for the utility, uh, you know, token holders to not only hold that token being used in the platform, uh, but being part of the decentralization, the validation of transactions as well. Super excited about that. Uh, we've had some questions actually come, you know, directly to me about our marketing as well. Uh, you know, listen, I, I know that the team, the marketing team itself, I, I say marketing team, there are multiple marketing teams that we have. Uh, they've been working extremely hard, uh, creating some amazing graphics, 
Uh, you know, once again, working on social media all over the place. Uh, I feel like our social media reach has increased uh, exponentially this past year, uh, just based on the metrics that I've been seeing as well. Uh, you know, one thing about, you know, people complaining about marketing, uh, I feel that, you know, I actually take that as a positive. They're paying attention to the project and they care about the growth of the project, which I do as well. Uh, so, I, you know, I do implore any community member, uh, you know, listen, you know, the, the crypto space in general is quite young. Uh, a lot of you guys have tons of experience uh, checking out the marketing and different, you know, sort of uh, programs that, that different projects run. And if you have any suggestions, send them over to myself or Nikhil or to Noam or anybody on the team. Uh, we're happy to take a look at it and happy to do what, you know, what we can in order to grow the project uh you know we, we actually have some amazing influencers uh, some youtubers take notice of the project as well and cover the project uh which is fantastic uh we've had some you know posts on uh coin telegraph bitcoinist uh some amazing sites that have picked us up as well uh really excited about that uh but wherever, wherever we're falling short if we're missing anything specifically that you know i'm not touching on feel free to reach out to us we're always looking for more things to do uh so once again thank you for you know whoever has reached out continue to do so uh, we've had some questions on our on our biz dev as well, how we're growing out with the different companies we're working with. Uh, for example, Federated Co-op FCL, uh, one of our amazing clients, we built that food uh, certification automation system for them. Uh, now FCL, they, they do about $10 billion a year, a year of revenue with one of the 50 largest companies in all of Canada. Uh, very excited to work with them on any sort of project. Uh, they come to us you know, very recently with a, a, a whole new vertical they're talking about. Uh, we, we're working in multiple verticals with FCL already. They're looking for quick wins with Morpheus in order to attach it to the certification system. Since we already have all the suppliers on board onto the system, being able to tie all that data together makes it a lot easier. Uh, obviously, we're an approved uh, you know, software service for them as well. It makes it easier to work with Morpheus. So uh, really great relationship with FCL. Uh, you know, meeting with Ray Garo all the time, uh, with, with Noam and Ray having a great relationship and the whole team as well. So uh, thank you to, to FCL. Uh, Noam and Carl have been, you know, hard, hard at work, of course. Uh, they actually just came back from Dubai, uh, which, you know, obviously I wish I can go. I wish I was able to go on that trip. I had some familiar responsibilities, so I could not make it to Dubai. Uh, they had an absolutely amazing time. Uh, what's exciting about it is that they actually signed a, a brand new contract uh, with Gulf Tainer, uh, that is the world's largest privately owned port operator. Uh, that's in the entire world, the largest privately owned port operator. Super excited to be working with Gulf Tainer as well. Uh, they have they actually run ports uh, in Dubai, but also all around the world, the United States, a couple of different ports uh, in Saudi Arabia as well, which we're very excited about. Speak a little bit about that in a little bit. Uh, we're actually, you know, having our, our great partners out in Spain, Polaris Network, uh, you know, Polaris Spain, speaking to the port in Spain. Uh, we have a, one of our great ambassadors connect us to the port operator in Canada as well. Uh, these systems that we're developing, uh, specifically with Gulf Tainer right now, the port operation, uh, this API hub that we're developing for them. Uh, amazing technology that could be used over and over, overlap for all these different amazing port systems out there. Uh, you know, right now in the news, very, you know, very much a hot topic. Uh, the backups at the Long Beach and at Los Angeles ports. Uh, we've had, you know, politicians even say that Christmas this year would, in, a, in, in essence, be canceled because we can't get the supply chains to run smoothly. Uh, I got to say to those politicians that we have some amazing solutions that can help with those problems. Uh, we're in November right now of 2021. Uh, let's make sure that, you know, Christmas 2022 is definitely not canceled. Uh, we're never going to have these problems again if we're using the right proper systems, connecting all the data together. So uh, very excited about those, you know, different port operator solutions. Uh, and thank you to Gulf Tainer. Uh, looking, uh, looking forward to building out with Gulf Tainer, uh, different ports all around the world. Uh, now, once again, I've had some great questions about the, the project in uh, Argentina with Senasa. Uh, that's the Food and Drug Administration, if you will, of, of Argentina. Uh, it's a fetal sanitary traceability solution that we have down there uh, using IoT devices uh, and also now discussing actually using our uh, advanced QR codes, uh, smart QR codes allow geolocation based on the scanner's location. Uh, being able to trace uh, all the pesticides, uh, the, glyph the, the glyphosate, uh, you know, Roundup style products. Uh, the fetal sanitary traceability solution is going to allow Argentina to track all the pesticides across the entire country. Uh, very excited about that. Uh, you know, obviously Polaris, uh, Polaris Network in Argentina, uh, Jorge Marcos, uh, also our client with Vitel Can. His whole team's been working so diligently, uh, diligently on that project as well. Uh, working with different IoT vendors, uh, with our partners Geotab and a part of it. Uh, also with our partners Telefonica uh, down in Argentina, specifically for IoT devices. Uh, very excited about that project. Uh, we have a few other uh, amazing government projects on the go as well through our Morpheus Network Solution Providers, our MNSPs. Uh, we have MNSPs all around the world, uh, obviously in Australia and the UK and Africa, uh, United States and Canada as well. So very exciting, all these different projects they bring to us. 
Uh, one thing that I, I have to speak about, and I, you know, very excited about all these different competitions that Morpheus is entering, uh, and not only entering, but winning as well. Uh, one in particular I have to mention is the EWC, the Entrepreneurship World Cup. Uh, they're actually sending the team down to Saudi Arabia. Uh, out of over 100,000 companies that entered this competition, uh, we have been now narrowed down to the top 25. And we get to fly down to Saudi Arabia, present in front of these amazing judges, uh, rub elbows with these amazing C-level executives, uh, meet different corporates uh, down in Saudi Arabia, uh, might even meet some, you know, partners of ours who run ports in Saudi Arabia as well. So very exciting. Uh, that geolocation, you know, we're being flown out there. We had to go down there, uh, meet all different partners. Uh, the, the competition itself was, was absolutely fierce. Uh, I was in a, a WhatsApp group actually with the top 100 uh, companies, a part of the EWC. And, you know, the amount of activity that these uh, you know, representatives of the companies were putting into this WhatsApp group must have been hundreds of messages per company per day flying through my phone. Absolutely unbelievable. Uh, obviously, the presentation that we put together, uh, we had to do a, a three minute uh, pitch uh, on the project itself that I put together, uh, as well as uh, three minutes uh, just speaking about, you know, reasons we have the project, what we're looking to do in the long run, those sort of questions. Really amazing stuff. Uh, then we met up with the EWC team, uh, had a 15 minute interview with myself, Noam and Carl as well. And they let us know that we're going down to Saudi Arabia. So super excited about that. Uh, also have to mention that we're finalists for the uh, Enterprise Blockchain Awards. Uh, what's great about that, that's, that's actually the awards connected to Don Tapscott, someone that I absolutely respect in this industry. Uh, I will say that uh, back in 2019, I went to this uh, big blockchain revolution award, uh, blockchain revolution event. Uh, John Trask was speaking there. He actually presented Morpheus, uh, met a whole bunch of people in crypto as well. Really was amazing to be there, uh, meeting all these different people in, crypt in the crypto space. Uh, and now we're actually up to win an award as a part of the Enterprise Blockchain uh, Award Show, which is connected to blockchain revolution. So really exciting, amazing validation, obviously, to be a part of that. Uh, we've actually also been uh, selected to be part of the Desjardins Open Innovation Challenge for 2021. Desjardins, which is a large bank in Canada, gives this amazing exposure in Canada to some amazing corporates. Uh, the point of the event itself was to introduce uh, Morpheus and all these different technologies uh, to these different corporate entities. So really amazing to be part of that. Uh, and of course, uh, for 2021, uh, Morpheus, along with Ferry to Co-op FCL, we are the PTAG Prize uh, for Supply Chain Excellence Award winner. Really exciting. Absolutely exciting. Huge validation. Uh, past award winners include uh, software providers such as Honeywell and some amazing companies that have won the PTAC. And now Morpheus has won that as well, along with FCL. So we're you know, co-winners together for that food certification solution. Extremely exciting. Uh, one thing I'll point out when it comes to uh, FCL, when it comes to Gulf Tainer, uh, when it comes to different competitions, when it comes to our, our MNSP network, our Morpheus Network Solution Provider Network all around the world, uh, all these different entities, competitions, companies, all different multipliers, just pushing our growth all around the world. Super excited about that. Validation that we have these solutions in place being used by enterprises, not only being used by enterprises, benefiting those enterprises, winning awards on top of that. Really looking forward to growing it out even further, pushing the solutions with new companies that we're speaking to, pushing them within the companies we're working with as well. So once again, thank you everyone for these amazing questions. Super excited about every part of the project, whether it's the, uh, the node system that I discussed, the exchanges, uh, obviously the biz development stuff, the new hires that we have as well. So much coming up down the pipeline, guys. So once again, everybody, keep the questions coming. And as always, have a great day.